What is up everybody? Got a game of Sector Control here, Medal of Honor. I'm using the M4 with the combat sight and uh, open tip ammo. Put that out there real quick. And uh, we're playing on this map, uh, Kunar Base I think it is, uh, that I really don't like. But uh, on Sector Control I found it quite a, a bit more fun than I do on uh, other game types. And in general I've, I've sort of started to like Sector Control more than uh, more than most other game types. And uh, this game type is very similar to uh, Conquest from Battlefield Bad Company 2. So if you like that, try this. I sort of feel like this one, this game mode is also the easiest to play if you don't have like a team or a group of friends you're playing with in that way, which is one of the reasons why I sort of like it, because I don't always have friends to play with. But, uh, yeah, um, I think we win this game. I can't remember. You get an okay score, but, um, as far as this gun, uh, the Spec Ops class, or Special Operations class, whatever it is, it's probably my favorite class to play as. M4 is probably my favorite gun. This guy's trying to be cheeky with his shotgun. I think that's in this game. A little later on, you get to see me killed by a shotgun. It's like super far away. It's pretty funny. But yeah, like uh, on this map, there are th th uh, three points, and of course, you're going to win by taking uh, two of the three for the majority of the amount of time. And it caps off at, I think, 1800. I'm not sure. Before you win. This game's pretty quick. Uh, that is one another reason why I like these. Uh, this game type a little bit more is because it's a quicker game. Uh, it's more to the to the point, I guess. But here, I think this is where I start getting a nice. I forgot to put my notifications off. I, I think I had to run over and like close my door or something. But yeah, I think I go on a nice spree here. Get a double kill right there. Okay, it's not where it happens. But um. Uh, as you can see, I got my my first kill streak things, and I decided to put in the UAV, which um, uh, unless there's already one up, uh, you should always put it in because it's incredibly beneficial to your team as a whole because everybody has you know a map with blinking enemies on it, and that's more important than you you know getting using your mortar strike and trying to get a few kills maybe. The only reason you should be using the uh, those offensive ones is if somebody else already has a a uh, UAV up. If you're playing on a team, of course, you know you can split these things up and trade it off, and to make sure everybody's doing it something different, and that's really going to help you win. Now, uh, this map you got to be careful with because it's it's so small and so many people are in this game type. I got sniped there, which is uh, the reality of playing this game. A lot is uh, a lot of people in this game snipe, and yeah, just like most shooter games these days, majority of the people are snipers. Yeah, I think I start doing kind of lousy right here. I think they start pushing up on our base, and that's what you don't want to happen. You don't want to be you know confined to your your spawn point. You always want to make sure you can get out and uh, you know make sure you're picking up bases. You're not letting them keep too many for too long. Otherwise, you're definitely going to lose. Say so most of the time when I play this game, I lose. It's kind of strange, but uh, it's all right. This one finally got a good game here. I thought I saw a guy down there, but there wasn't. There are always a few spots in uh, in all maps that uh, are really good to check every single time because there there are a lot of places to hide in this game, unfortunately. Just like Modern Warfare 2, and there's plenty of little holes and gaps for people to try to hide in. It's not, that's no fun, but uh, it's there anyway. Really, could not tell where I was getting hit from. I guess it was up there. I think my teammate saves me here. That's some really bad aim with my pistol. Yeah, my teammate saves me that one, but yeah. Pistols. I really enjoy uh, the pistols in this in this game. I think they're very good, uh, particularly if you're using like uh, using the shotgun in your Spec Ops class. You're, you're going to want to use your pistol quite a bit. 
Uh, I get a nice double kill. Or something that resembles a double kill. I get a achievement. I'm not sure what that one is. But yeah, you're going to be using your pistol quite a bit if you're going to be using like a shotgun class or something. The shotguns do have pretty obscene ranges in this game, but uh, still you're going to want to use your pistol because they have even greater range. Yeah, I'm, uh, as for killing or getting kills in this map, it's a really good idea to sort of chill out in like a like a room or something. I don't want to call it camping, call it defensive play. Uh, some people call it patrolling, like an area, and peeking out every now and then trying to snag a kill. And that's really what this game's all about: is a uh, very defensive gameplay, which is one of the reasons why I'm not as fond of uh, multiplayer as I was is because it's so oriented to defense. At least I haven't found in a way to to, effect, to effectively rush yet. I've tried with the shotgun, but I um, still have yet to get a decent game with that. Yeah, nice. Thought I got a double kill here, I guess not. Yeah, that corner is one of the places people like to hide as well as at the end of a sort of long hallway. You'll always find a sniper there, usually. Another thing I find funny is that it'll look like sometimes you don't get the kill, like like the other person kills you first, but as long as you get a f quite a few hits on them, it won't specifically say sometimes if you got the kill or not. Sometimes it'll say at the bottom, other times it won't. So don't be too discouraged when you don't see the other person go down, because chances are you you probably both just killed each other. Is that That's a result, I guess, of the uh, realistic ballistics that are in this. Yeah, anyway... That's the end of this game. Uh, we win, which is what it's all about. Played like a team, we won. I think I go, uh, get like a 1.5, I think. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching.